Well, there's a lot of good things were said last night, like I said, but now it's a, now it's a case of you guys putting into action what we said, what you said last night, what we said as staff, and coming together to make sure it's a, a good end to what's been a, a brilliant week, yeah, with the way you've applied yourself, how hard you've worked, yeah, and, and you've shown your resilience, you've shown your robustness, you've shown how fit you are already. Now it's about adding up little bits of quality. Final message from me, guys, I know for a fact, I don't know if it's six people or it's 26, but I know that Bournemouth flan, uh, fans, uh, Sam was on a flight of a couple yesterday, flown over to watch you play. I know a few um, Bournemouth fans that live in Spain that are driving two hours to watch you today. So that is a responsibility of hopefully where you're going to, of what people will do to watch you play, especially when you're in first teams. So enjoy that pressure, but that's a privilege, guys. So make sure you do everything you do every single day that represents the values that, that you put in every day of the club and the way we work, guys. So all we want to see is our identity with the ball, our identity without the ball, and our humbleness to go and get the ball back as quickly as we can. Are we ready, Dom? Yeah. How you doing? You okay? How are you? Yeah, all good, thank you. Vamos. Vamos. Looks at it, isn't it? Five. Yeah. Five, four, one E, five, boxy one. Wing backs pushing one, probably. Come on, get after the ball, Dale. Go on, Joe. Finn's behind, Give Finn's behind. Some cake. Good lad, good lad. Nice start. Good, half and half. Just Finn's, Finn's aware of the 11. So this guy. Good, you, you yeah, can always block him up. Dom, if you need to stay deep, Dom. Stay deep. Nice, Johnny. Good, Johnny. Torre, go side. And lucky, John. The back three, it's how we deal with that. Because it's hard in the heat to go. We want the wingers to jump, but then Finn's got the 11, he's a threat. If he comes yeah, down to the three. It's got to be on the first pass from the keeper. Anything after that's too late and we miss him. Are we staying striker to still go first wide centre half? And, and yeah. we, we release the winger on the switch? Yeah. So you see at the moment now? Yeah. With Noah going up there. Their wing backs can stay in, can stay and then their front three, which block these early passes. As soon as they get pressure, they're then just locking from here and going, like ready to go, 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 so they can almost come out. Yeah, they just never come here. I agree, have one because it's him, you might get tours. Yeah, could do. So we could do a little bit like they are, and build with a wide three. Or the four, but it's the front line of three that's just blocking the middle and getting pressure on the ball. So what, go four, two, four in the build? Yeah, just get Noah down, see if we can get their wing. But then Dom and Ash stay high and wide. Yeah. Ash, on the build, stay out. Tell Noah. Yeah. On the build, building a four, low. Dom, stay wide on the build. Tools, on the build. Four, two, four. Go on, tools! Up, Johnny! Up, Dom! Tight, Finn! Tight! Let's go, Dom! Let's go! Come on, Lou! Tight, Harold! Yes, Dom! Well done! Boys, if, obviously, we're the Blues. Now we're asking to go 4 2 4, where their wing backs want to be aggressive. If we had Noah too high, it was almost too clogged up in there. So, a bit like the Birmingham game, lower on the build, it might be them sharp old, the old 4 3 3 1 2s, Noah, where Ash might come down, bang, and that one on the inside, you and Michael did a lot, Finn. You remember in the 4 3 3 days when we played that? Yeah, so 4 2 4 Dom stay that, give us that whip. You can roam when we get to good position, uh, possession, Dom, but initially it's building a 4 2 4 to try and stretch their back line. Boys, it's a great challenge for us, end of a long, hard week. This is the, this is the moment you find out more about yourselves and you, and you top up those character levels. When we say, oh, we've got lads with good character, these are the situations you go through to build that character. All right, so push yourselves through it, guys. Yeah, well done, come on, let's go again. John, you're getting quicker. Let's go, John, overlap. Overlap, Johnny, hold it, key. Lovely. Knock it. Get a shot off. Good strike. Calm. Hey, well done. Stay high. Good. Get your body there, Dom. Good boy. Good Harold, tight, tight Harold, good boy. Good Harold and Dom. Calm.
Well played. Well done. Come on, Finn. Let's push through it. Come on. Come on, Nigel. Good. Next one, maybe, Dom. Okay, not now. Good, Johnny. Good, Tors. Up. Up. Good, Ash. Okay. Be aware of him, Finn. Come on. Uh, Boys, it's tough. I know it's tough, right? I know it's tough. Think how hard the last week in particular has been, and even really the whole three weeks. Okay, so we know we're not at our freshest. It's part of the pre-season process, guys. Then you add the heat of that and the quality of the opposition, it becomes really tough. But if it's really tough, what does that present? A huge challenge, guys. So embrace the challenge, guys. Embrace the challenge. Okay, I know it's difficult. I'm not here going, Ben, do it. Um, ben, do that better. Lou, do that. Johnny, do that. I'm trying to help you guys, but you've got to help yourselves a little bit as well. How can we help ourselves better in, in with a general, what's the, the, the frustration? The goals, obviously, but what else? Yeah, better on the ball. How many giveaways? Uh, and it's, that's why we do the rondos, the tight technicals, and everything matters. Every, every action counts. Because when it's tough and you're tired, can you still make them little sharp passes, guys, and make good decisions when you're tired? Okay, so let's be tidier on the regain. We've got pace and massive pace and power coming on in those wide areas of Remy um, and Kobe. It will suit Dom now as a 10 to find those pockets. Okay, but it's important that we get the tactical bit right, guys. Yeah, it's, it's really important. Cause they're, and they're going to be fresh as well. They're probably going to come after us again, which I'm happy with because we've obviously conceded three goals in our own third. It's going to give us a challenge where we've got to do it again. How we do it, we'll, put, we, we, we'll, we'll work on it in training day in, day out. But ultimately, guys, you're the ones on the pitch making decisions. So it might be, it might be bounces out. The way we're stretching the game is because of the 2v1 wing-backs that we spoke about in the, in the mini-break. Yeah, so stay wide where possible. It might be a little sharp one-two. You might draw the outside centre-back. You might set Finn. Um, or you might be able to turn and get him. Okay, so the 4-2-4 build with the low full-backs will go with. Just on that, Tom, just have a look yeah. at the, the Fellas, just have a look at the screen. Think about the work we've done all week in terms of stretching out the opposition when they look to press. Just here where we're pinched off the sides and we're pinched in here. It just helps them to really press at our goal, and it's tough to get through. Okay, so full back's nice and low. Uh, Lou in here, it might be left foot and then right foot out to a low Noah. Wide men pinning back in here. Okay, give them a choice about whether they release. And then Cal should have a choice. If they come tight to our wide men, might be a chance to go on those out to him runs that you've seen this week. Okay, it's a great second half for us, for a challenge, a test of all those things that we discussed last night. Because if you're going to get where you want to go in your careers, it's not going to be easy. And if you're going to get where you want to go in your careers, the challenge right now in the safety of our support is the best time for it. Okay, so when you go off your own way, you are ready for what comes next. So be ready for the second half. Any, it's hot, it's the end of the week, I've worked hard, get rid of it. We know all that. We've got 45 minutes in front of us with a good group of players. So embrace the challenge. Trust yourselves and trust each other, and let's come back in here afterwards, ready to travel home with real positive things to talk about. Okay? Everyone happy? Come on then, fellas, eh? Come on. What a pass. Go on, Oh. Let's go! Well done, Carlos! Inside cover, Rem. Good, Carlos. Good, Carlos. Good footwork. And again. Yes. Good. Stay good. Well done, boys. Well done, Carlos Dom. Ben, good. Well done, Carlos. Love it. Good regain. Harold! Harold, when Lou's on it and he's playing in midfield, don't need you near the touchline. Narrow. Yeah? So we can find you and protect the middle. Go on! Go on, Archie, you can't give up. Good. Connor! Hold. Yes, Carlos! Lovely support, Carlos Gregory. Go on, Noah. Go on. Great support, Carlos. Arrive, Kobe. Well done. 
Your character has shown through, your willingness to push through difficult moments has shown through. Keep the reactions high, guys. It will save you running with the sharp reactions like you have been doing, Carlos, Nige. Really good regain, Nige. Boys, even this difficult, Carlos, even these difficult moments are higher regains that led to the goal because you're willing to go to put yourselves through that. Okay, 15 minutes, big effort, physically, mentally, but make sure we're together in everything we do. Come on. Yes, chop the Remy, chop through. Come on. That's him again, isn't it? Go on then, fellas, hey! Home, 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 home. Good, keep her, keep her, keep her. Good. Good. But come free, Luke. Seconds! First pass. Aggressive, Carlos, aggressive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, boys. What an interesting game. Thank well you, well played. Thank you very much, well played. Thank you, well done. Thank you, well played, thank you. Well done, good boy. Well done, Nigel. Well done, Carlos. Well done, really well done, good boy. All the best. Hold on. How do you feel? What was a big moment in the game where you have to feel the game and sense the game and the momentum swing? Probably two real situations for me in the second half. Huh? The red card and the first goal. So the first goal, you know, it's like, right, get the ball, get the ball. And the game changed. All of a sudden, all the build-up man-for-man patterns that, that we might look to, to create space, it might then be, like we said to you, Cal, it might then present a different challenge. It might then be centre-half centre travelling quicker, pin them on the top line, and then we start to sustain. So think of all our training work. We had a build to counter through, but then the game's changed because red card. It might be travel up quick, get in their half and sustain, especially when they drop deep. So recognising and feeling them moments, in my opinion, is really important, guys. Really important. I know how much you wanted to win the two games, like I did, the staff did but you can work so, so hard and you've worked ever so hard this week and sometimes you just fall short. And we had that, that last year a little bit, obviously, with the, the playoff situation where, with the goal difference. So it's a constant reminder why we've always got to push more, we've always got to seek them bits of improvements, guys. But think, guys, think how you as an individual and us as a group can refer to this week in particular and the three week, uh, two weeks previous to that, how hard it's been. Seven days, constant, double sessions, spin sessions, gym sessions, hard runs, Dealing with the ball when you're tired, which is a big factor of today, I think you'll agree. So you've got a real reference to refer back to this week. Cool. When it gets tough in the season, yeah, I've got it. I've, I've got it in the bank. I've put that hard work in pre-season, and we've still got work to go in pre-season. We know that. But that in the second half is everything we spoke about last night. The togetherness we've shown last year, this year, the, the character you've showed it, you know. And I need to. Um, I've highlighted him this week a fair bit. But our captain for the week. Last Sunday, the manager pulls him and says you're going to go with the 21s after training with the first team all week. So, Ash, did he, did he sulk this week at all because he didn't go to LA with the first team? How did he train? Hard. With quality. Did he lead? Did he, help, did he take Johnny Day under his wing? Did he inspire? In my opinion, yes. But a week ago, he was probably desperate to go to LA and, and experience all that, which would have been great, and play with, play with the first team, play against Arsenal, whatever. But he's here and he's worked his nuts off because he wants to be a football player. He wants to be a football player. And that, for me, is a, is, is, is a bigger message that I, that I can give. That's a, one of your peers, one of your teammates that's done that, Harold. And the two goals, obviously, the icing on the cake. But I think that's a really good example. But everyone, for me, on this, this week has been at that level. He's the one that obviously had that slight disappointment. And it's an easy one to use for me with the two goals. But everyone has trained like that and that's why it's been such a rich week guys it's been such a fulfilling week for, for me to lead to watch like we said last night and to lead you guys and like I said the staff have been unbelievable in every aspect and I thank every member of staff because I can't do I can't produce a week like this without the support yeah so we need to make sure that we understand that like we said last night and we use all the support we've got 
like we said, when the challenges get tough, like Tom said at halftime, draw on that support. Yeah, to make sure we embrace the challenge and kick on. And I'd rather today have that than win 10 nil. Genuinely, I would. Because that's going to serve us well and you better for the future by what happened today. All right, but it's been a really good week, guys. Proud of everyone's efforts. We recover, obviously, now. And then we look to build again next week and go again, guys, and look to add. That's always the mindset. Can we improve next week? Okay? Thank you, everyone. <laughs>